Hello there, my name is Richard McMunn from the interview training company PassMyInterview.com and in this tutorial I will teach you how to answer teamwork interview questions and in particular I'm going to give you some brilliant answers to common teamwork interview questions. So it does not matter which role you are being interviewed for, if you think you have to answer questions relating to teamwork, please watch this tutorial from beginning to end because this is what I will cover. I will give you great tips for answering teamwork interview questions. I will tell you how to demonstrate being a team player in an interview. I will give you teamwork in competencies and how to demonstrate them. And I will also give you answers to common teamwork interview questions to make sure you pass your interview. Now, before I do that, a very warm welcome to this teamwork interview questions and answers training tutorial. My name is Richard McMahon. That's me there in the center of the screen. I have been helping people for over 20 years now to pass their interviews. And I always do that by giving you top scoring, brilliant answers you can't find anywhere else. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel by clicking the red button below the video and then you will not miss out on any of the training videos I'm uploading. Please also give the video a like because that then tells me you enjoy the content and I'll create more for you. Also, if you tell me the name of your interview in the comments section below this video, I will give you some additional interview questions to help you prepare effectively. So let's get into those teamwork interview questions and answers. The first teamwork interview question we need to prepare for is, what are the qualities of good teamwork? So this teamwork interview question will give you a solid foundation for answering any teamworking interview question. Make sure you learn the skills and qualities needed to work as part of a team, and then the rest of the interview will be much easier. So here is how to answer the teamwork interview question, what are the qualities of good teamwork? In particular, there are nine really important skills and qualities for good teamwork. These are being able to listen to the team brief carefully to ensure you can all follow any instructions to the letter. You then need to be able to work to the team's strengths by allowing team members to do what they are good at doing and also making sure you all follow a plan of action. You also need to be able to communicate effectively, both by speaking to all other team members during the task or project, and also listening to what everyone is saying. You also have to be adaptable and flexible throughout any team task, as things can and often do change very quickly. You must also motivate and support your team colleagues. And finally, always look to improve and develop as a team and learn from every experience you encounter. So that is a very strong answer to the interview question. What are the qualities of good teamwork? I like that answer because you are focusing specifically on a set number of skills and qualities, which in this case is nine. That shows you really know your stuff and you know the qualities of good teamwork. Now, the next teamwork interview question I want you to prepare for is, tell me about a time you worked well as part of a team. Now, my advice, and this is really good advice, is to use what's called the STAR technique when answering this teamwork interview question. So you're going to structure your answer using situation, task, action, result. And in the answer that follows, you will see how effective it really is. So here's my answer using the STAR technique to tell me about a time you worked well as part of a team. In my last job, I was part of a team who was responsible for packing and sending out customer orders. One day, our manager had an impromptu 24-hour sale with a 50% discount, and the sales went crazy. It was our job to work together to get all orders dispatched within a 24-hour time period, as per the promise we had made to our customers. We decided to allocate specific tasks for each person within the team, based on their strengths. My job was to pick all orders, check for accuracy, and then pass them on to the packing and distribution team for dispatch. At one point, I'd completed all of my work, so I went over to the customer service team to help them take orders over the telephone. The end result was we managed to get all orders dispatched for our customers on time by working together as a team, keeping in constant communication with others, and also doing additional jobs outside of our remit when capacity allowed for it. So you can see there how effective situation task action result really is. Follow that format when answering any kind of teamwork, behavioral interview question, and you will score the highest marks possible. So the next teamwork interview question I want you to prepare for is, what would you do if a member of your team was not pulling their weight? Now, most people will answer this question by saying they will either do the work themselves or they would inform their team leader or manager. 
However, this is the best way to answer this teamwork interview question to pass. Here we go. I would see this as a wider team problem, as anyone not carrying out their duties and responsibilities to the necessary standards could impact the rest of the team and our combined efforts. For a team to be successful, everyone has to do their job properly. On that basis, I would speak to the person in private to find out what the problem was. They may have a personal issue at home or they may not be feeling well, in which case I would offer to support them to get them back up to speed as soon as possible. If it was simply down to the fact they were not doing their job properly through a lack of motivation, I would explain how their inaction could have a detrimental effect on the rest of the team and that they really needed to sort things out quickly. Although I am not a manager or a supervisor, I would still see it as my problem to help sort out for the good of the team. So that shows you are taking responsibility, even though essentially it's not your problem. It would be down to a supervisor or a manager. But because you are a team worker, you are sorting that out for the wider good of the team. So if you would like more behavioural interview type questions and answers, please click the link in the top right hand corner of this video. It takes you through to my website passmyinterview.com and you can download my full set of top scoring answers to common behavioural interview questions including ones relating to teamwork. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. I'd very much appreciate your support. Don't forget to tell me the name of your interview in the comments section below and I wish you all the best for passing your interview. Have a brilliant day.